What's going on, you boy, man? It's your boy Cash Out JD, man. You know, we back here with another video, man. As always, boy, Cash Boys, welcome. You know what I'm saying? With another video on this blessed Good Friday. You know what I'm saying? I know most of y'all niggas probably in school. I don't know what y'all doing, but me, that's not me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't in school no more. You feel me? So, don't fuck all that. I do, we got another video, like always, man. It's uh, another, uh, another Jerry Springer, JD, Jerry Springer special. You feel me? Another JD Springer special on God. But I have something to get into, bro. These couple individuals right here, bro. Niggas saying I talk too much, bro. If, and if any of y'all other niggas think I talk too much, bro, y'all go ahead and comment it. Y'all have freedom of speech. Y'all have a right to say what y'all want to say. But nigga, if that's the case, if I'm talking too much, you see the video, you see the title, go watch it, my nigga. Real shit, bro. Don't come and watch a reaction channel if you don't want a nigga to react to the shit. To the, you know what I'm saying? Don't 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 do it, bro. Don't let's not do that, bro. Let's not do that. But to my niggas who respect and fuck with what I'm doing, shout out to y'all. I mean, if you don't fuck what I'm doing, let me know. I can switch it up. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't gonna change who I am. But I can switch some shit up. Let's get All into right, this Rebecca shit. Rebecca says jail can be a lonely place. Rebecca. I mean, yeah, nigga, you in jail. Yes. Um, do you know the show Orange is the New Black? Yes. But look at her. Oh, why her head shaped like a perfect egg, nigga? Literally. Oh, oh. It's like she, was, she got a I weird ass head shape. Yeah. Oh. And it's like you're in a slap on the like wrist. Like 50 plus people. And yes. Yeah. You literally can't do nothing. Like, can't mess with no females. Can't touch them. You're busy, like, all the time. Oh. So you're like in jail, horny for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> and, Bro, what? Um, so is she like, gay? She must be gay or something. We was in, I was off by the kitchen duty one day, and she I was a freak. Like, I could see. You hear her? She's oh. like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm. uh, I just want to wave to all our viewers in jail. <laughs> <laughs> they watching and Jerry Springer in jail. I was watching the show there one yes. day, and I seen my ex, Taylor. Oh, well, you're watching the show in jail, and your ex is on our show? Yes. Whoa, that's fiance. a crazy-ass coincidence. I'm not going to lie. He was looking good and everything, but, you know. That's a crazy-ass coincidence. Doing on our show? Getting married. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Do we have that clip? Wait. Oh, let's see. Niggas get this married on the Jerry Springer show? On our show, getting married to someone else. Yes. Niggas is getting right, married? That is crazy. Your best friend was there, and she had put some stuff in my head, and I'm really sorry, but... Me and her have slept together that night. Damn. Oh, shit. She smacked fire at that nigga. She smacked fire at that nigga. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Because I really do love you. Regardless of what, regardless of who she is or what she done. She mad as a nothing, bitch. Nothing can change the fact of how much. So why did she go to jail? Just me. Will you marry me still? Yeah. But it's going to take a lot to trust you. So why the fuck would you marry him? I mean, like, I'm not, I'm not hating that they could grasp to him being married, but why would you marry a nigga you can't trust? That that's, that's kind of stupid. What a, Making what a bad life decisions. You don't see that on Lifetime. So, you don't. So, uh, oh, so he was marrying this other woman. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, I had got out of jail in June. Yes. And I, I had actually seen Taylor at the store. Oh, so okay. you bumped into it. Yes. Yeah. And he was like, how are y'all? I was like, good. How's married life? And he was like, well, we're separated. Oh. And. Damn, like, well, niggas fucking up. Chill some time. I was like, okay. So a couple days later, he chills with me. And we actually had a lot of sex, like, <laughs> marathon of Fifty Shades of Grey, that bad. <laughs> yeah, I mean, shit. He knew what he was doing, bro. His wife at the grocery store. Yes. How many and times did you go like, to the hey, store? Girl, I was money? like, hey, and she was like, um, how are you? I was like, good, how are you? He was like, she was like, you know, I'm married now, like happily married. And I was like looking at her confused because I'm like, um, okay, because you know, I was just sleeping with her yeah. husband yeah. a couple days ago. Okay. But she was telling you they're happily married. Yes, yeah, so I was like kind of like confused about it and everything. Yeah. And then we started like hanging out more. Why are you confused like, about it? About everything, oh, like sure. I was, bro, the nigga obviously wanted to just get in your shit. You, it was a less likely chance that if you knew they was really like together, good marriage, and shit like that, that you would have slept with that nigga. Less like, I mean, you probably you was horny, so you probably would have did it anyway. But 
You know what I'm saying? Bitch, stop lying. But you know what the nigga was doing. I know what the nigga was doing as soon as she said it. I brought her on the show to tell her I slept with her husband. Oh. <laughs> That's another thing. Do you know they're married? Do you want to be with him? No, that was just like I was out of jail and needed to have sex. Oh, I see. See, look, I know. Yeah, so you, you that makes a lot of sense. Like you just want to let her know that. But you know damn well that's gonna break up their fucking marriage, dude. What the fuck is you talking about? You don't wanna break up their marriage, but you're gonna tell her that you fucked her husband. You wanna break their marriage, man. Yeah. Well, uh, she's outside the studio, so she hasn't heard any of this. We're gonna bring her in. You'll tell her. Okay. Here's Katie. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? What type of ad promotion? Bro, get this ad promotion off this TV screen. Man. Hey, Katie, welcome back on the show. Hey, Jerry. Yeah. So, say um, what I want. This is my shit. How, how is, because on the show, you got married. Everything's well, I fuck with y'all, bro. It's going great. We have our falls, but whatever, what, a, what marriage doesn't. Yeah, and it's not going okay. Damn, what, what, what falls, is it? We have our falls, but whatever, what, a, what, what, what marriage what? doesn't. <laughs> It's going great. We have our falls, but, but whatever. whatever. What, 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 what marriage what, doesn't. What, yeah. <laughs> now it's going okay. All right. We're good. You two. Bro, this nigga. I have something to tell you. Like, you know, me and, I don't know if you know, but me and Tyler's date was like way before you. Paige told me about it. Yeah, well. Um, Come on. You got to know what she finna say next. You know what she's finna say next, bro. We had like a lot of sex. <laughs> bro, who was the nigga who did that? That nigga is a hoe. I ain't even cool. He gas the fuck out the house. That is crazy though. That y'all was separated and y'all weren't together. When's the last time y'all had sex? Not yesterday. <laughs> About a week ago. A week ago. We just started uh, in and out a week ago. Yeah, that's why I brought you on here to like say I'm sorry and kind of tell you. Bro, that nigga. Oh shit. Oh shit. To like say I'm sorry and kind of tell you. Bitch. <laughs> Oh yeah, round two in this bed. You heard the bells, round two in this bed. Oh yeah, let him, let him fight. Fuck it. You mad cause your husband. <laughs> ah, this was funny as hell, boy. But I didn't watch this growing up. That's crazy, bro. Yes, your husband, he ain't wearing his ring, bitch. Mm. We've known each other since we were kids. Okay, you can't be mad at me because your husband wanted me again. I mean, I did know him way before you. Oh, is this is the first time. This is the first time you've all this good for your husband. You want it right? Whatever. So you're, what you're saying is you don't want to be with him. It's, no, I don't. It was just like I there. got out of jail and Don't wanna, Did you have any reason to believe that he was cheating? Period. Not no, cheating. Jerry. Yeah. Everything's going good. We, I literally just went and got us our own house. We move in November. Damn. Why would you talk to him? Here he, he is. is bro, he a dumbass, bro. That nigga's an L, bro. Yeah, fuck this nigga, bro. He a scumbag ass nigga. Really? Twice. Twice. Yeah, but you took Twice. the ring off. Twice. Yeah, but you. I Twice you cheat on Smack me. that nigga, man. You ain't loyal. Yeah, but still, you need to pipe your attitude down a little bit. Pipe my attitude down. I take care of you. I cook. Shepherd I can pie. tell, bro. Lasagna for your ass. I cook crazy. Damn, crazy. boy, he was your getting a... Nah, bro. Him. Yeah, leave that nigga, bro. I ain't even like divorce that nigga. Take whatever he got, bro. Leave that nigga. This is one woman that I encourage to leave her man, bro. Every day or night. This nigga's Guess a fucking. What? Good job. You a wife. <laughs> you don't treat me like one. You treat me like I'm just a bitch. Hell, uh, Steel, you took your ring off. You like ten times, Jerry. Oh yeah. Like she, she like every, like every time we get in an argument, it sits there and she be like, I'm done, I'm done. Like walk off and throw her ring across the house or something. Like it, when you marry, that's a commitment. You take that ring off, you broke your loyalty. Nigga, I what? I broke my loyalty. I broke my loyalty. I mean, yeah, because you know what I'm saying? Like, if she, That's like taking when somebody, ring when off, somebody yeah. tells me they do, I'm about, to, I'm about to get back on my grind. I'm about to worry about me and my money. Yeah. Whatever I'm focused okay. on. Okay. Like, you worry about your money, where's the job at? Why? That about to happen. Take care of you. Yo. 
Damn. Okay. I just got to pimp over birthday. I got to limit. What do you do? Not a damn thing, Taylor. Damn. She on your head. Be a husband. Head top. Y'all, you want to have a kid? Damn. Yeah. Clap to that. You sit there saying get a job, do this, but how am I supposed to get a job if you live in the country and the closest job is way up the damn highway somewhere? Back in the day, you they used to do? walk, get a bicycle, do something. I love my get a bicycle, nigga. It is the walk back in the day. Yes, you, yes. Kid, you actually do. Because you kind of just saw it a little bit. You're married, woman. you ought to go out and try to get a job. You're a healthy young man. Right. Go out and get a job. You know what I'm saying? I Do I vows mean anything to you? Hell Do they no. mean anything when you take the ring off? Nigga, yeah, taking the ring off don't oh, mean shit. Oh. No, you don't take the ring off when you watch. Oh, shit. Oh, your wife getting dragged. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is bad, bro. This is bad. I know. Look at them niggas, bro. Nah, I mean, you're pulling her hair, that, bro. It's not a small thing, the cheating, obviously. <laughs> but does he have a point that whenever you guys argue about anything, you kind of... Well, I would not be giving a fuck with Jerry Tom Because right, you know, I, mean. I see you're pretty active out here. <laughs> so that could kind of make a guy think, geez, what, this is not a relationship Jerry, I want to be in. I'm 20 years old, and this is yeah. my first marriage. I don't know yeah. the first thing about a marriage. You don't go into a marriage thinking it's your first. <laughs> you know, it's. What? That's all she worried about it's, herself. It's your own. I'm worried about myself. Yeah. How? That's crazy. Like you always, you always come on the center complain when, whenever I want to rap. You like? Cause you're up all night long. I like to sleep. I gotta what you mean? I'm she providing all the dough. Yeah, nigga, shut the fuck up. Let her sleep. Fuck. She got all the money. You the one trying to rap, bro? You. Bro, how old is this nigga, bro? It work. Where Where's the man? money at? What you mean? You gotta get there first and take steps. You gotta start somewhere and then get okay. there. Like you, but you gotta like realize. You. Like I got bigger you dreams. Like, obviously we don't. You gotta realize you got you know, responsibilities, on the same level bro. Like me, I dream of bigger. Like I, I got bigger dreams. You wanna live in a damn a double wide or a, a modular home? A home-wide. That's why we're living in house in November. Yo, for real, for real, screw that house. I want a mansion. Okay. Nigga, good job, bro. What this nigga? All the female talking about feminists, like feminine men, he's a he that that's him. He wants to be provided for. If I ain't talking about some fucking house, you gotta give me a mansion. Nigga, what? Nigga, a house is pretty good. A mansion is just excessive, nigga. Like a house is cool. A mansion is excessive as fuck. What do you need a mansion for? If it's just y'all two, or even if it was just you, what the fuck you need a mansion for? Big as hell for no reason. Empty as shit. For real. I got bigger dreams, so I'm you being serious. Imagine, you want I'm, dedicated. I'm dedicated money to my jewel, though. Money takes it, so get, God, get some money, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about? Exactly. So, so, so where's your grind at? Where's my grind? I'm trying. You said my I can grind, get paid. My money goes towards rent, electric, phone bills. It's different. Wi-Fi. But you just got to sit on your ass and watch Lifetime while I'm out here doing What do you do with sitting in the bedroom on your ass rapping? Buddha, Buddha, Buddha. <laughs> Buddy can't rap. You guys obviously love each other, but you got to spend five seconds thinking about where is this going? And Facts. you, that's, really, a, that's a thing though. I don't know where You have going. a beautiful big dream, okay? No, no one's saying you shouldn't have your dream, but it starts out by actually getting a job and working for it and then getting Thank you. doing better and better you, you, you can be do doing both, I do everything bro. myself I do I do everything I do, I do my mixtape covers I do my mix and mastering Every everybody laughing at you gang otherwise have the money exactly I mean, how you gonna fund this you shit? know the great artists they all start out with some job I also want you my know, name I also want my name to be on my face card to be good It'll what be the fuck good, are you talking you gotta get a job oh, I want to know that but you can <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm not saying yeah. stop your music. Pursue you can that. do both, my nigga. When you get up in the morning, you got to go to work. That's got to be in your mind. I'm not saying everyone can find a job, oh, yeah. but the fact that you live in the country is not a reason not to have a job. Oh, it okay. is. Okay. No, niggas in the country got jobs. Trust. Okay, so there's nothing's going on here. You don't want to be with him. It was a 
Oh, I'm not putting words in your mouth. Is that true? <laughs> I said right. he's fucking broke. You got that right. So so you two gonna but stay you together? Me... You two gonna stay together? I don't know. I don't know if I can trust him. You okay. can't. We'll be back. We'll be back in this. Do you think that was wild and crazy? Damn, I think they broke up. I would have shit. Bitch, I'm breaking up with your ass. The fuck? But yeah. Fuck them two people that said I talk too much or three people. You fuck y'all niggas. I'm going to keep talking niggas. My reaction video. I fuck with y'all though. If y'all fuck with me, I ain't even finna lie. I'm not, I'm not on no cocky shit. I'm just saying like, bro, you don't like me talking, bro. Go watch the actual video. It's just the video's already on YouTube. I'm just reacting to it off YouTube to put it on my YouTube. Nigga, you don't got to watch my shit. You can go watch the regular video. But thank y'all for tuning into my video, man. 20 likes, man. I'm dropping another one. We're really going to drop another one out of the day or tomorrow, man. Y'all have a good rest of y'all day, man. I'm going to see y'all in a minute. I don't know. Who knows? Shit. Peace.